So YouTube, this is Manish from Tech Portal, and in this video, I'm going to show you this A5 2017 ROM for Samsung Galaxy G7 2015 variant. So here, let me show you that A5 2017, and I am currently using G7 and F variant, and it is currently running on Android 6.0. So here, let me show you the security patch. The security patch is of 1 November 2016. And it is really a smooth ROM prepared by Alush and Mix 3 5000. And here you can see that it is fully debloated. You can access these four touch features on many of the apps. And uh, it is really smooth. The file size is around 1 GB. And uh, you will get all the latest features of the Marshmallow stock ROM of A5 2017. All the new apps of S7 Edge Note 7 ROM ported for A5 2016 or 17 ROM. So here we are in uh, 2017, and here we have the settings, the quick setting option like connection or sound notification. From here you can easily access. So let's check how many RAM we have available after first boot. So here you can see that after first boot we are getting around 400 MB, almost 400 MB free out of 1.5 GB, and after clearing all the apps. Running in the background, we are getting around 500 to 600 MB free always, which makes my J7 a little bit faster. I am not sure about the battery backup till now, but let me show you the best thing of this ROM is that the VOLT here you can see the VOLT is supported. Let me show you this here you can see the VOLT and both the sims, my Airtel and my Geo 4 is working perfectly fine. I have provided the link to download this file and the wall fixed for A5 2017. Sorry, I get always confused about the 2016 or 17. And uh, let's just let me just show you the N22 benchmarks. So here I getting around 40,700, almost the highest score I have ever seen on J7. On if you compare it with the Note 7 ROM Advanced 7. Or CM Resurrection Remix ROM, many other ROMs which are available for G7. It is the greatest score ever for G7 2015 variant. And also, the game launcher is working perfectly fine. Here, you can see that the game tools, whenever I try to open any app, it will automatically open these game tools. And you can easily access all the features of this easily. Like, if you want to take screenshot, if you want to access your recent apps from here directly, and it is really fast. Here, you can see that I am easily switching apps anywhere and I am not getting any lag so let's just go again here and the RAM management the memory management everything is just amazing so I hope you really enjoyed this video and if you like this video a like will be appreciated and for more videos like this you can subscribe to my youtube channel by clicking on the subscribe button down below as always I see you in the next video thank you peace out